everyone you're welcome to see mom's kitchen you're welcome to my youtube channel my name is cynthia as always i am excited today but today i'm specially excited because i am going all the way to my motherland in enugu state to bring to you fio fio okay fio fio is a special delicacy from the eastern part of nigeria precisely enugu um, it is also called mumbu or they also call it mbigbi all right, so today we're going to be making fio fio and achicha. Okay, it is highly proteinous, nutritious, and also less expensive to prepare. I recommend it to pregnant women and also breastfeeding mothers because it is high in protein and also rich in iron as well. Join me today as we present fio fio and achicha. Here are my ingredients. So here is fio fio. Okay, it's also called mbungu or habibi. Okay. So in English they call it uh, pigeon uh, beans or peas. All right. So here is a uh, achicha. All right. Achicha is made from dry cocoa yam. So this is what it looks like. When it's still dry, it looks like this. So what I did was that I had to soak it overnight to achieve this. Okay. So when you soak it, it becomes soft. As you can see, it's soft now. Okay. So this is the hard one. And after soaking, it turns soft. All right. Here I have onions, already diced onions. Here is my salt. Here I have habanero peppers and bell peppers. I also added onions. Okay. Here is my red palm oil. All right. And finally, I have uba. Okay. So in, um, in making few of you, you actually do not need to add crayfish or maggi. So this is how my mother and my grandmother taught me to cook um, fio fio, to have that rich, natural taste. Please join me as we begin with the process. Thank you so much for joining me. So here is our fio fio or umbumbu in the pot, okay? So we're just going to cover and allow it to cook on it until it becomes soft, okay? We'll be right back. Okay, so it's time to check on our fio fio, okay? All right, it's cooking really well. So now that it has cooked, it's soft right now. So we are going to add uh, chicha, okay, so that the steam from the, uh, the fio fio will cook the, uh, the achicha. I've been cooking this fio fio for the past one hour, uh, 30 minutes, okay, so it depends on the heat you are using. Sometimes people prefer to use um, firewood to cook this just to save gas, okay, so but we don't have access to firewood, so we are using gas here. So I've cooked for about an hour, 30 minutes, all right. So I'm just going to add uh, chicha, all right. So the steam will cook the achicha, all right? You can see that the water is below uh, the pigeon peas right now, all right? All right, so we are going to cover and allow the achicha to cook for the next 10 minutes. I will be right back. Okay, so while waiting for uh, fio fio to cook and the achicha, we are just going to make our sauce, okay, for the fio fio. So we are going to add palm oil. Fio fio needs a lot of oil, okay. So we're not going to bleach it, we'll just heat it up, okay. And then we'll add onions. Okay. Fio fio needs lots of onions as well, okay. So we'll just fry this. One other thing about uh, fio fio is that when you eat it, for the rest of the day, you drink lots of water, <laughs> which is also very good for those who do not drink water, okay? As you know, water is very good for the body. Once your um, onions turn golden brown, or it depends on how you like it, you add your peppers, okay? So I also blended some onions in this pepper as well. Okay, so we're just there. At this point, we are going to add salt. Okay. We're going to add some salt. And it's there. It looks really good. So we'll just fry this for about um, two minutes and then uh, the sauce will be ready. Okay. 
So I'll just taste for salt. Okay, it's perfect. Like I said earlier on, to achieve uh, the natural taste of um, fio fio, you do not need to add crayfish or maggi cubes. Okay, or bouillon cubes. Sorry. All right. Okay, so our sauce is ready. Okay, so we are going to check on our fio fio to, to know if that's ready as well. Okay. So we're just going to check on our fio fio to see if there's still water. All right, so the water is almost dry. We'll just leave it for another two minutes just to make sure the water dries up completely. So it's time to check on our fio fio. Okay. I hope you can see it. I know the steam is coming out too much right now. Okay, so it should be ready by now. Okay, so what we are going to do now is we are going to scoop out the um, the achicha. Okay, from the fio fio. I hope you can see it. Lots of steam right now. Okay, so we'll just scoop it out. Is the top. Okay. Scoop out the achicha. doesn't matter if you have just a little bit left but I'm um, just scoop out the most of it out okay so now what we have left in the pot is a uh, fio fio or umbumbu okay so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to mash the fio fio okay a little bit so that at least it becomes soft it gives a better taste when it's very very soft okay all right so i'm just going to use my pistol to mash the um fio fio okay so it becomes soft all right it tastes better when it's very soft okay okay i hope you can see it so i've mashed a fio fio or umbumbu okay so you see the way it's looking all right Perfect. So what we are going to do now, we are going to pour in our chicha. All right. Back into the pot. All right. Some people like their uh, chicha um, kind of tinier than mine, but I enjoy mine like this. Okay. I love the taste like this. All right. So I'm going to add our sauce into our chicha and fio fio. All right. So our sauce goes in and then we are not going to forget our uba, alright? So we just make sure we scoop out all the sauce into the pan. Okay, and here comes our uba into the pot. So what we are going to do, we just turn on the stove to low heat, very low heat, okay? And then we are going to turn everything together. This gives me so much excitement right now because I just feel like I'm at home right now. I feel like I'm way, way back in Enugu State. All right? Mm. So I'm just going to mix everything together. Uh, okay, now. <laughs> Next time, I'll marry a Lokisha woman. <laughs> Somebody's jealous, so. <laughs> okay, so we are just going to mix everything together. You see how it's coming out? Yummy very yummy and healthy too okay so we'll just turn everything together mm. all right so i recommend that you give your kids this food and you also eat it yourself all right it's very healthy all right just going to turn everything together so it took me about almost two hours to make this um, delicious fio fio, all right? So I wanted to use my pressure uh, cooker, but I realized that the quantity I made is um, not going to fit in, okay? So that's why I didn't use my pressure cooker. So if you have a big pressure cooker, you can use a pressure cooker to cook this as well, all right, to save time for you, okay? So as you can see, 
our delicious fio fio is ready okay it looks really good you see it looks very good and yummy too all right so we're going to come back and uh, dish out the fio fio so you can see it properly all right the way it's usually served all right stay tuned and join me as i dish out our delicious fio fio Go, our fio fio and our chicha is ready. It looks delicious and ready to dive in. Okay, hope you can see it clearly. This is what it looks like. So this is the fio fio and our chicha garnished with dry fish, also known as um, mangala. All right, with the pepper sauce on it. Okay, so here we're just going to try our fio fio and our chicha. All right, I've been salivating since. Can't wait to try it. All right, just watch me. <laughs> all right, let's give this a try. Mm. 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 This is really, really good. Okay, you should try this. All right, so all I'm going to be doing for the rest of today will be drink, drinking a lot of water, which is very good for the body. All right. Thank you so much guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. And if you are new, kindly subscribe. Alright. Uh, support Simon's Kitchen. We appreciate your support. Thank you so much for being there all the while. Okay. Enjoy your day. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Bye bye.